You just gonna watch it from my one? Yeah, I'm watching it from your one. Okay. Tell Vishal, tell the fans why we're here, because I'm I'm gonna straight up load this to YouTube. Okay. Today Who are, are you? Watching... Who are you? Oh, uh, Who are I'm you? I'm Auntie, I'm Auntie, I'm Auntie. Hey guys, you guys might have heard about me. I'm pretty famous among these parts. Did I hide uh, the chat or no? Because we might see some penises here. <laughs> uh, this is where I you need to I don't, I don't know like people are hyped for gears 6 they're saying gear 6 black op 6 or no maybe i missed saw did they say gear 6 what well, gears are oh no just gears of war never mind yeah, there's black yeah, op 6. i think some people are excited for gear 6 i'm not i'm excited for the collection the marcus phoenix collection yeah okay hopefully but hopefully. so so who you are know, you who am i who are we i'm auntie yes i'm a that reoccurring kind of character on the Technics channel stream at twitch.tv slash Technics channel. But they are saying and... Gear 6. No, no, they are sometimes just saying Gear 6. Is is it up to 6? Yeah. Oh, okay. But, so like, like, okay, so we're, we're about three minutes away. Yes. For the Xbox showcase. And who we're am expecting, I? Uh, you are the sole streamer himself. The man, the myth, the legend, who I'm surprised I even know at this point. Well, because he's so famous. We, we already in, know all this. In this Mesopotamia. Is, this, wow. This is common knowledge. I'm talking more, you know, who are we in relation to this? So, for those of you who don't know out there, me and my auntie, we are long time gamers. And I'll be honest, I don't remember a single day, unless forced, where I haven't played video games. And ironically enough, one of my first consoles, I don't know about Auntie here, but one of my first consoles was actually PlayStation. I actually started with PlayStation because that's what my parent had, my dad. And uh, I played his PlayStation, and then we didn't have it anymore because I think we sold it or something. And then eventually I got a PlayStation 2, but then I moved to Xbox and I never went back. So Xbox is a long-time person in the gaming sphere, long-time competitor with the non-american counterpart sony which many of you would know from playstation now me and auntie eventually diverged because we both were on xbox we both were american made but then auntie switched sides and went to the japanese side of playstation but you know we still like xbox we still think xbox has pretty much in a way lost the gaming war because for a long time when we were kids right it was always xbox versus playstation always 360 we would say one over the playstation 3 right ultimately ultimately yeah but after that pretty much xbox restructured or not restructured but refocused on different things mostly on pc mostly on other stuff and then they eventually kind of just lost to, to PlayStation, mostly because they're trying to focus on PC and just, for a time, especially with the Xbox One, they tried to be a all-around console, not just a gaming console. They tried to overreach, which at the time, I think they were smart for. I just don't think they did it right because the Kinect sucks ass, and that was forced. Um, The shitty Kinect, as we used to call it. Oh, what the? Oh, shit. Whoa. Canada? All right, I don't like this already. Yo, they're starting early. I wasn't even done with my intro. Uh, uh, close your eyes. Close your eyes. Oh my eyes. god. Oh my god. I'm not old enough for this. Holy. Oh, never mind. It's just counting down still. All right. We still have time. Oh, yeah. There's. Wow. So they're starting with Black Ops 6. So I was going to say this really quickly. Um, One of the premier games from me and Auntie's childhood, and I can say this with confidence for him, was Black Ops. Oh, yo, that was Raul Menendez from 2. We, well, I have personally played every Black Ops. I have a lot of opinions on COD that we have no time to say, but let's just say this is near and dear to our, our hearts. They better not fuck this up, but they probably will. Oh, oh. All right, rumor has it, this one is based off of Black Ops 2. Really? Oh. Yeah, is that Nixon I just saw? Despite I think so, it was 1991. No, that's not Nixon, there's no way. These events clearly serve our national interest. Whoa, look at the graphics. I hope they don't show up only campaign. I saw the Illuminati symbol. Oh, that's Bush. Yep. Yeah, I think they're going to 9-11 in this. Really? Today we yeah. celebrate the mystery of American 
Renewal. Do you think eventually? Wow, that was fucking. Well, he's, uh, yeah, he's alive. Yeah, these people are all alive still. Bush is still yeah. alive, right? Yeah. Yeah, he is. So we could go ask them if this happened. Yeah, yeah, I know. I have your <laughs> number right here. But, oh. but, but, they, but they prefer FaceTime. Oh, I thought they had Android. <laughs> No, 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 they're, oh, they're, 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 you, works. they're going back to uh, Cold War, by the way, with this, because Adley's here. He's a character from Cold War. Black Ops 5, technically, which they didn't call 5. Yeah, they're just showing off. Yo, they need to show off zombies. I can fill up this whole streaming time with zombies talk, by the way, but I won't. But. This is the Cold War? How was it 1991? It's not Cold War, it's from Cold War. Oh, they got woods. Hey, oh. What the whoa, fuck whoa. was that a was that a mannequin? That was a that was a Jalik. Oh my! Yo, look at Adler. He's like, come on. I want you to realize, you know how Nuke Town was twenty twenty five. That's next year. That's actually true. Holy shit! Lies. Michelle, it doesn't. Actually, I could see it looking the way it did there. Honestly, yo, the AK. Yo, oh, oh, are they oh, doing that kind of the max? You just saw. He just died back. I mean, that's probably just a visual thing for the kid. Okay, I don't think no, I actually either. read that they're bringing that up. Oh, actually. okay, okay. Did you read this too, that you could you go on a motorcycle? No, 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 I can't read that much. Oh, okay. I'm you a have a limit seer. every day. I'm a great seer, remember? Yeah, you don't understand. Wow. May God continue to bless the United States of America. Yeah, while we fuck every other country on the earth, yes. Yeah, yeah. And now we're you bleeding the, the people. Oh! oh! It was Fat Boy! Oh, okay, come on, what the fuck? It's Fat Boy! Because I like Phil, come on. Fat Boy too, I like his fellow. It's an honor to stand here representing the creative teams at Activision. And please stay tuned after the show. Tell all that Game Pass money is going to is now. Inside the studios, to hear directly from Treyarch and Raven, who are mm. working on Call of Duty oh Black God. Ops 6. Is she okay? You'll you get a 25 minute yeah, deep dive into dizzy. the story and a sneak peek Please, at zombies. multiplayer. Oh. Bring my Gears of War yes, collection. Yes, they said zombies, they said zombies. It's been 10 oh, years did, uh, since Call of Duty has been in our show. I was busy show. arguing with myself. It's been even longer since all Call of Duty players got the same game at the same time. Wow. Going forward, now only PlayStation's getting it. the game including the Black Ops 6 beta, the season expansions, and the updates at launch. Oh, wow. There are currently over 100 million people who play Call of Duty every month. We hope to every grow day? that community by what making Black Sundays? Ops 6 the first Call of Duty. On Sundays, they, they, go to, they, they go to church on Sundays. Yeah, on Sundays, they have five people. Day one. So no they don't say where that. You choose to play, everyone is welcome <laughs> to experience the I mean, Technic, Call of Duty Black up. Ops 6 mm. on October 25th. Okay, October 25th, I'm there it is. I'm incredibly excited for today's show. Are you really? Standing here thinking what are you not excited, Phil? That has gone yeah, let's, to I wonder if Phil could come on and say, I don't like this one coming, but it's you guys might. <laughs> to share the latest efforts around the world. You guys might like it, I don't. I don't want to be here. Activision. Bethesda, they didn't pay Blizzard, <laughs> and Xbox games. Ew, Blizzard, ew, ew. Who are doing what I believe is some of their best work ever. You say that every year, Phil. And now I get Philly. to introduce something that is special to me. Gears. Gears? As someone who Gears. has played games for as long as I have. Hey, me too. It's amazing that I get to I played games for as long as I have too. I think premiere. everyone did. So thank you all for joining us. What kind of saying is and that? Enjoy for as long as I have. Right, Rogue Premiere. World. Is it, is, it, is, it, is, it, is it the Naruto X oh, Hunter Hunter, Hunter Crossplay? No, it's Bethesda. Uh, yeah, Skyrim scissoring cyberpunk. Before he became a hero, he was a villain. He was the super weapon of gods and kings? What the fuck? Is this okay. new or is this a content? What the hell? There was a pentagram there. Is this Doom? Oh, it might be Doom. Yeah. Oh yeah, shit. Yeah, it's definitely Doom. I wouldn't call the Doomsayer Doomslayer a hero necessarily, but oh my. These games are fun. I'm not yeah, even gonna lie. They're pretty good. I'm glad what they did with the series. Like they really modernized it. Oh, oh he has a my... shield now. Oh, he's got the fur of Akalon. Oh my god. That's only in the prequel, because Akalon comes back. Oh, no. Oh, no. 
Look at that one. Oh my god, that one's bad. <laughs> I thought oh you were going to Oh my god, he's it. shooting skulls at them. Oh my god. Michelle, this might be Gears of War. That's the Lancer. Yeah, I know. Oh my. The Doom Shield. Oh my god, he's Captain America. Oh. Oh my god. No, I, 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 I will not deny, like, this is one franchise, like, I actually really, like, whenever there's a new game, I like there's a new game. He's just beating it. Oh my god. Oh my god, they have Max. That's a Gundam. Oh shit, oh, it it, it's Spyro. The Dark Age. See, I don't understand. How is this a prequel and we don't have any of this in the current day? Oh my god! In the current day oh. game. Oh, we have to wait 10 years for it to come out. It comes out 2025. Yeah, man. Oh, so far. Play it on Game Pass. Wait, what's your. Every person who gets Game Pass makes Phil Spencer 0.1% fatter. No. Oh, no. Make sure you get your Game Pass. What are they presenting? Box oh, snacks? I wish. You before? Last of Us? Who did you love? Oh my god, Michelle, look, it's The Last of Us. It's Ellie. What did you believe? Oh man, I just woke up. I'm a little tired. Undead Labs. What a name. I, I, I know, for like a zombie thing, right? People are saying, yeah, people are saying State of Decay 3. Yeah, I think this could be State of Decay. I never played this series. Neither have I. I don't really play games anymore. We're adults now. We don't have time for that. Games suck now. Wow, I, mean, you know, you get I agree with the second half of it. <laughs> oh, God, you put it in his mouth. In each other. Oh, this might be the new zombies. Oh, yeah, they're like... Oh, wait, is that a man or a woman? Wow. Oh, no, I know what this is. You didn't, you didn't see this. This is The Walking Dead. Oh shit, you're right. Yeah, and they're collab with Last of Us. No, this is the this is uh, Marvel vs. Capcom. Oh yeah, seven. Uh, seven. <laughs> oh, it's co-op. Okay. You didn't have to kill that one. Well, it seems like they make noise, right? I feel like we're past all the zombie craze. Like, you remember uh, the whole I, era where like every I, game was a zombie game? <laughs> Somebody put the first of us. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> What's going on, Nahid? No, this it is the good, new Nahid. Mortal Kombat. Appar I used to think the same thing, but apparently zombie stuff is extremely popular, more than ever, apparently. I feel like if it's your first time, like, it's good, but if you've played, like, five of them, you've played probably every oh, zombie look at, game. Oh, I, I like, I'm not gonna lie, it's actually a pretty cool Oh, she's dead. Wow. Yo, shoot her, too. Shoot her, too. I didn't know you. Or him, know. I don't know. Have I seen the oh. March skin? Yeah, I don't know if it's a skin though. I think it's a new character. Wow, she took her dino. It's like that army taking a dog tag. Every sacrifice wow. And we'll never you know where that dino is going to go now, right? Uh, I don't want to know. <laughs> Maybe you don't. Maybe Phil Spencer will tell us. <laughs> That's why he's excited. <laughs> That's the main thing he's looking forward to. Oh my god. Oh wait, I hear a big one. Oh, oh. no. It's Elijah. No, I knew the reference would come in. I was thinking between that and Jalik. No one oh. is forgotten. Wow. Marshkin looks hot now. I don't know, I gotta see more of it. I don't think it looks too hot. Oh, yep, three. There it is. State of Decay 3. I'm illiterate. Can you tell me what See, it says? Yeah, I, well, I just said it. State of Decay 3. Oh, okay. I can't hear you. That's okay. Helen Kelly. Oh, wow. But, you know, I hate that people can guess these out. You know what I dislike? Nowadays, most games are just continuations from old series. We're not getting new shit. Oh, EA? Anthem! EA? Anthem! Oh, my God. They're bringing back Anthem, but in Lord of the Rings. Not looking good, old friend. Ew. Ew, are they dwarves? Ew. What are you the scout? What the hell is this clown person? Yeah, don't let him near women, Elijah's too dangerous. You're not wrong. Oh no, head. 
Oh my. What is this? Bioware might need to die. I don't know if Bioware can like recover. I, you know what I think they're trying to do? They're trying to go off of the uh, the Baldur's Gate craze. This looks like they're trying to copy Baldur's Gate, but like in Bioware style. Oh, he's the Necromancer. I like that. What the f oh, oh, this is a character I'll play. And dragons? No way. Not the dragons. Wow. One more thing. This crew needs a leader. I swear to God, I hate this type of writing. This type of writing is so like general. It's so normy. Oh, she, she got a she fucking likes, bunch of freckles. She, she likes him. You like that? Yeah, yeah. I wonder why. But where are we gonna find that? Yeah, where are we gonna find that? Bro, this is so the, cheesy. He's the leader. So cheesy. What is this fucking thief? It's like an MMO, probably. I hope not. I don't know if I like the graphical style. I like the colors. I don't like the stylization of the characters. Dragon Age? What? Ew. This looks more kitty. This looks more like a kiddish Dragon Age. Ew. Ew. Yeah. Now it's just one after another, though. Holy shit. I want new games that are good. Bro, every game is like, we it's like from a series already. You chase dreams and break shadows. Anatoly. Anatoly yes. from from the guy who lifts weights. No, no, it's it the guy who it. made France. Anatoly oh. France. Oh, okay. We have received a distress call of unknown origin. Oh, space aliens. There is no record of a star Starfield. Star I don't know. That came out already. Something is not right. It's aliens. It's aliens. They didn't show, but they, they also shot themselves in there. The graphics are pretty good. Ah. The, the serpent's will. It's religious. There's the devil. What the fuck? What the fuck? They look like a cum spider. Yo, people are saying Gears 6. It could be Prey, yeah. It could be Prey too, yeah. Dead Space? Nah, I doubt this is Dead Space. This can't be Prey. I don't think Prey is like this, is it? Uh, maybe. Yeah, maybe not. It's definitely not Dead Space, though. Dead Space is more fleshy. Not cum related. I think it's a new IP. Uh, maybe. Can you feel its embrace? Somebody said Fallout 666. Oh my god. There is no more you. Oh. Only us. Only us. Oh wow. Oh shit. What the hell? Oh god. Looks like a movie trailer almost. Looks like the music too. No Man's Sky? No, it's not No Man's Sky. Oh, it's... Oh, Star huh? Man. I, I Rog. Chris. Wow. That's that's one cock slap. So is this a... Oh, yes. Is this a DLC or is that a an actual new game? I'm from I guess it's a new DLC. We have a proposal for you. All right, we get it. Why are you showing it? Okay, we know it's Starfield. It looks like this is a DLC, if anything. But... I wish you the best of luck. Yeah, well... I never played Starfield, so I wouldn't even know, like... Oh, look, look, the shop, the shop. Yeah, the fact that they... Nah, the fact that they added that in, that is so ass. This trailer needs to get slapped out now. They showed the shop in the trailer. Get the fuck out of here, yo. Fucking greedy ass fuckers. Oh, my God. That is so... Like, they advertised the shop in the trailer. Look, people are saying L. Wow, they're they're a hard saying L. Holy shit, Bethesda. Oh well. Oh god, they're still doing Fallout 76. Ew. I love Fallout. Fallout show is amazing. Reviewed it on YouTube. Oh, it looks like we've got one. 
carries on from Skyline Valley. He's oh. sending the whole family. Look at the new Coca Cola. Oh shit. How about that? Skyline Man, Valley. fuck Vault 76. Right in the heart of Shenandoah. You know, I actually heard Fallout 76 got pretty good too. Yeah. It's just sad that like it started out so shit. Oh, the, oh wow, that is a map expansion. And the over 17 million vault dwellers already on board. And let's wow. keep those numbers climbing. Yeah, how many of those people <laughs> stuck around though is the real question. Vault 76 is a growing community. And strong community can weather any storm. Why, just take a look at our Skyline Valley neighbors in Vault 63. Oh, wow. Oh, damn, yeah, look at them. Ew, they're fucking ghouls. Cooking up shocking new ways to protect and preserve this Appalachian Eden. Yes, My God. Skyline Valley is a stunning portrait of Mother Nature in repose. Oh. National Park, Fallout 69. Friendly local residents, Yo, that was a turkey. Valley what the hell? And don't forget to bring home a souvenir or two. You know, the only sad part with Fallout to me is that, like, dropping, all the Bethesda games up. feel like Call shit. To reserve your place in Vault 76. Like, if you, if you, yeah, you, you felt Still too, Michelle, right? Mm -hmm. Well, like, they don't feel like shit. Oh, look, you could play as a ghoul! Best of luck out there. Oh, wow. Wow. Oh, Look at this. World premiere. world premiere! Wait, they didn't say this for the other world premieres. Is this one special? Sandfall? Fuck, what did Sandfall make? What is this, Italian? Soon she'll you, you took Italian. And oh. Again. Oh, this is Fallout 34. Oh, never mind. They got rid of it. 33. Ew. This looks weird. Every one of that Their eyes are in a line. Thanos? Is this what? devil make cry? What did Thanos do? He farted. Year, an expedition departs for the continent. With Look at his arm. You know what this reminds me of? What was that new game that came out? Lies of P? The painters. Yeah. Kind of looks like that. I never played that game, though. Death. It's a good Again. game. Mm. From what I hear. J I, I made J play it. We'll break yeah. the cycle. So she can't steal anyone else's future. Oh shit. This world is full of wonders. Oh wow. The world looks really cool here. Hmm. Oh wow. My question oh. is, it may look cool, but is it actually like fun? Good. Yeah. Oh god, what are these quick time events? Ew. Wait. Oh, it's like persona. It's fucking it's turn based. What the I have no big issue with that. I don't know, to me, it's a little weird. It's almost like a D&D type game. The music reminds you of Devil May Cry. Have you heard of Tabletop Simulator? Yeah, a little bit, yeah. Apparently you can play almost any card game on there. Oh, wow. It's eight players, so we all can play card games. Oh, wow. Even if we fail, this is we lay the trail for those who will come after. <laughs> this game looks a little right. weird. It looks good, but it looks a little weird. We. Oh God. Oh, God. She, she's you know, afraid of. The, you know she's afraid she's, of that number. You know why she's crying? Why? Because only thirty-three people bought the game pass. Oh. Bell needs more. Oh. Okay. Look, look, he's trying to get you to buy it. Okay, right. gears. Xbox Game Studio. I'm assuming Gears is gonna finish the show. Yeah, I was about to say they're probably gonna end with Gears. My mom's still alive. What the if fuck? Anything like you She'll keep fighting Apocalypse, fight. zombie, space. Those are the three. Yeah, things yeah I was seen. I was just about to say that. Like it seems like that's the trend. Space, apocalypse, and maybe some old like medieval thing. This thing looks like it has 15 oh, yeah, FPS. Oh my god, it's moving. It's Torterra. As to Total. Big Gator. I gotta drop you off fast. After I got you out of that tree, you said you helped me find my mama. I ain't at disposition to find my mama. What is this? Bug snacks, too. 
I'm all ears. There's a church up a ways with a big bell. Go on and ring. What is it? Yeah, you're right. You what the hell is that? Talk ain't about the sound of bell. Her hand so is clipping into the fish. Take I can't tell if this is in game or a cutscene because her hand was clipping into it. You better not skedaddle. Go on now, scoot. Scoot. I'll pick you up yonder after to go find you. Bro, what are what are these companies making, bro? This better be good. This is obviously appealing to the Mississippi audience. Oh, okay. This doesn't look too bad. Gotta move quickly now. I don't know. What is she? It looks stop motion. Yeah, it kind of does. Yeah. That's why the FPS was low. Oh no, Michelle the Gator. Wait, that floating island is the Gator? Well, yeah, the fish just fucking said it before. Were you listening? Holy shit. Oh. I don't know. I feel like once, once I'm this old, like I feel like I've played almost everything. Oh, Nothing really is like interesting anymore. Oh my god, what the fuck? Ew. Ew. It just seems kind of barren. Like, her moves aren't, like, flashy. See, that's the thing, like... The sad thing I'm doing, and I always do this now, is I compare this to, like, okay, what have I seen, what do I know, right? Because I've seen thousands and thousands of games, so it's like, how is this new? Like, okay, that, that boss there did a rolling attack. That's so boring. But realistically, you can't make every boss do a new move, but it's like... It's like, this, this game definitely has, like, its little uniqueness to it, sure. But maybe for the combat it doesn't. Oh, see, like, this is cool. Like, I like this part. Like, this is unique. There's, like, actually, spirit. like, Spider-Man. Spider-Man does the same thing. Yeah, she has, like, spirit, game. like, parachute. Spirit whip. No. Pretty Dark Souls. Wow. Nah, this is definitely that shit, Dark Souls. I would relate this more to, um... What the fuck was that game on PlayStation with the guy who's electricity? Infamous? I think so, yeah, Infamous. What kind of reminds you? Damn, that's a huge gator, yo. This is the Mississippi in 10 years. Yeah, it really does look stop motion. Like, this shit is low FPS. Yo, use your fucking glider, you bitch. They didn't show me anything. They showed you the combat. The main thing is, right? Yeah, it looks out the midnight. I mean, again, obviously this is appealing towards like southern audiences. This is where certain game studios now, or I guess like Xbox, right? They invest into things even if they won't be big hits, just to like cater to certain audiences. Now I feel like, like they're obviously catering catering towards like the southern Mississippi River audiences. <laughs> oh God, no Blizzard! Ew, ew, ew. I mean, the only thing you care about is Overwatch. I mean, I barely care about that too, but yeah. I mean, I doubt Overwatch is. Reinhardt. Reinhardt. This is Look. Diablo. No, no, he flashes with his shield now. Oh yeah, he gets naked, and then you could see him from it. Is this Ew. wow? Is this World of Warcraft or what? Is, what the hell is this? Oh wait, it is wow. Yeah, this is wow. What? What the hell? What are they showing with WoW? WoW for console? Illidan. No way. If they bring WoW to console, that'd be insane. That will actually be crazy. Oh, look. Oh, shit. Deathwing. WoW Classic better than WoW. All they did was go back in time and re-release it. The common trend. Oh, God. The That's Mr. Pandaria. I saw that trailer on TV. This is crazy. Wow. Huh. Oh shit, Gromish. That's when they went back in time. Do you know any of this, Michelle, or no? Nope. Wow. I know the Marion. 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 And doing his son. That seems always looks so good. Oh no, Sylvanas. Yeah, and look, the jailer came in. Fucking useless ass villain, bro. Terrible. 
The Wild Lord is so crazy now. What are they doing? So this is this is Dragonfly. This is the current expansion. Is that Alex Straza? Oh my god, there's an- Oh my god, look at that sword! Yo, the final battle, that was supposed to be with the- with the fucking Jailer. Now, in the darkness, at the very what the fuck? The oh my god, it's the Giants. The drums what the fuck? He's missing an arm! Once again. Oh, she. What the? Oh my. What the fuck? Azeroth. Oh my god, she's awakened. Bill's gonna awaken. Bill Spencer. Who is this, Sylvanas? I don't know if that's a character we know, but if it's another, like, brand new villain, we'll be. Oh shit. It's a new expansion? Yeah, the war within. Wow. The darkness calls, so pay your monthly sub. Oh wow, it's this year. Look at that, it's in two months. Cool. I like how the chat is so like it's so split. I'm saying I've seen W's and L's. Oh, Konami? Resident Evil? Yeah, maybe. Soviet, Soviet, wait a minute. Listen oh, maybe up, it is actually. The graphics look, uh... The graphics do look the like they could be... Bring him back to, the west. to the west. Oh. Your code name for this oh, it's Snake. snake. Oh, wow. Snake from now on. Wow. Naked Snake. He is such Meta a fucking masculine Steve. icon. Yeah, Metal Gear on Xbox. Times have changed. Just leave no trace of your presence. Is that clear? Wow. This kind of infiltration is I don't understand how a game special. like this nowadays could survive. Words, I feel like this is like an older type game. Ew, he's wearing an alligator head! You're completely naked, just as your name implies. You're completely naked. I have to find my own weapons and equipment. Wow, Who's survival crazy game. Idea was this anyway? The mission rests entirely in your hands. Naked snake. One man army. Wow, snake is so cool, man. Holy shit, it's flaccid cock. Oh my god. I mean, this is cool. This is cool. Wow. Speak. Uh, like I said, I can imagine this game coming out in like 2010's era. Not like in modern day. I feel like it's not gonna be enough. Who knows? I mean, Snake, they, they could probably do it then. Who knows what they're doing? Oh my god. Oh shit. Metal Gear Solid Triangle. Delta. Math major. Math major. Commencing virtuous mission now. I feel like this was the same type of art they used for Metal Gear Solid 5. Exact picture of Snake. Obviously it was a different snake, but. What's the new MGR? I have no clue. I don't even know what the fuck MGR is. What the fuck is this shit? I already don't like the graphics. And the way they're introducing it looks like shit. Oh my god, it's stupid thieves, freaking to see thieves, it thieves. thieves. I never liked the graphics of this game. Eh, cartoony. Too cartoony for me. That's saying something. This is a game I wish we played. Yeah, I think it could have been fun, but I don't know. The graphics are so like, I don't like the style. They look, they look like Phil Spencer. They look fat. Look at that guy on the left. That guy's just like a block of meat. You want to see more Raiden? Yeah, Raiden's cool. Oh, Metal Gear um, Rising or Revenge, or whatever it was called. Okay. Yeah, the graphics for the, and the style is something I dislike so much here. Bro, I feel like every fucking thing Xbox does, they always have to talk about Sea of Thieves. Like, I can't believe this game is still going. I'm shocked. A44. What the fuck? Oh, this is, um... This just came out. I forgot the name of it. Oh, so it's not even, like, a new game? It's already, uh... I mean, I, I could be wrong, but... Oh. 
forget the name of it? I think. Because I am a god too. Maybe not actually. If you're a god, you're one of them. Why would I do anything to help someone I've This looks to so kill? dumb. Well, oh, yeah. It's the same type of game. Over and over and over. See, yeah, like, I don't know if it's just because we're older, right? Because, like, when we were kids, we would get hyped for most of the games. But now, like, I'm just thinking, like, what would make me interested in this? I don't know if it's, like, an adult thing. I don't know if, like, we're just jaded. I really don't know. Because, like, all these games don't inspire or spark joy in me. Like, wow, look, a new way to traverse. Whoa. It looks cool, though. Looks cool, yeah. It definitely looks cool. But graphics at this point should always look cool. There's no excuse for them not looking cool. Ashen. Oh, wow. Uh. Whoa, Souls Light. Does not look Souls Light. <laughs> Maybe. Yeah. yeah, this does not look Souls Light. I don't know. Come on then. <laughs> Lint lock. What the hell? She reminds me of Ori. A little like creature there reminds me of like Ori in the blind forest. <laughs> Is that Zed Yada? Who the fuck knows? I hope not. Oh my god, look, Phil Spencer. Ooh, game pass. Now they're just coming one after another. Phil only cared about Call of Duty. More Egyptian shit, wow. Was it Smite? Wait, ew! Of mankind. Nah, I don't think so, because they wouldn't... Oh, yeah, no, it's not Smite. This could be Civ. Bro, what is this? Is this Civ? It's like Civilization. Rulers of the Greeks and the North. Chris, this is your people. Look, it's Tor. The Egyptians. Do you think giants existed, Chris? No. Wow. We created mankind to fight for our glory. What is this? What the hell? This looks like shit. So what are these types of games? It's like the StarCraft game, RTS. It's like an RTS game. Command. Ew, yo, whoever chooses Vikings is ugly. Rain down. Whoever chooses Egypt Egyptians or sex. Yo, whoever chooses Greeks knows what's good. Oh my god, it's fiddling. What the fuck? Flash of cocks. Oh my god. Ew. Oh, look at the bird. Age of Mythology retold. What the fuck? Fuck. So I never had Game Pass, right? But they take off games from Game Pass. Yeah. Right? Okay. You don't know when. I mean, obviously, they'll tell you a little bit before time, I'm assuming, but. Yeah, but, you, but any Xbox, like, game itself it stays. Okay. Stop Carrington's attack at all costs. What is this? I always knew I had an instinct. I always knew I was special. Bought two game passes for Phil Spencer, for not one. I thought it was Look at her ass. Oh, this is this? wrong. Welcome to oh, Galaxy, shit. where it's a pleasant 23 degrees all day, every day. Oh, this is European. They said 23. Celsius. How far to his last known location? Local forces are also tracking his whereabouts. You need to find him before they do. Whoa. What is this? Generating voice print. <laughs> that sounded like shit. Oh, no, no. What readings are you getting? We're getting odd readings from your monitor. Can you confirm? That was Arabic, yeah, I know it was I'm Arabic. Right now. Our intel places Carrington on the second floor. 
Holy that's shit, that was so epic. Whoa, no, you like, hear the this music? Shit, this shit's putting me to sleep. Once once this lady started climbing the pipe, they played the Doesn't epic ass music. I'm not saying pussy sleep. It actually looks kind of cool. It looks cool, but it's like, was it really that big of a deal that she started climbing the pipe? I'm going in blind. This almost reminds me of Cyberpunk. The POV looks like shit. I actually like the POV. I don't mind the POV. It really reminds me of Cyberpunk, though, with all the HUD shit they have on screen. Whoa. Uh oh, the founder. Why wouldn't she shoot them through that thing? Are they dumb? No oh, camera shake is insane. I mean, it's trying to like do POV. It's trying to be realistic. Damn. Oh my god. They're missing. How are they missing? I must say, just th shoot through everything. Fuck it. Lose everything before I could see. This person has a gun, and you're running up to them with a knife. Like what? Is, what? Oh shit! She's getting hacked. I hope you're ready, Agent Dark. Hope you're ready, Christopher. I hope so too. Once you open this door, there's no going back. The fuck? Oh, Perfect Dark. I've heard of that before, I feel like. Oh, you know what? No wonder I, I didn't think it was that bad. Perfect Dark is... they rebrought it. Looks okay. I mean, I don't know. It looks whatever. Yeah, to me, I like it. I like it. I'm not What a game I would reach out and play on my own, probably Agent not. But... Dark is caught in the this is what they're spending time on? Mad Booty! Come on, Booty! Lives of millions. Oh we my hope you god. Enjoyed the first look at gameplay, and we can't you don't like Mad Booty? I don't like Booty. Developers at the this initiative booty. And Crystal Dynamics as the game progresses. The creativity and talent of game creators are what make our industry unique. And I'm incredibly proud of our games and our teams. Wow. They are building a diverse lineup of titles, which includes... New installments. In no one is not like gonna new notice new his new last name. <laughs> Updates and expansions. Booty. <laughs> Look at the chat. <laughs> World of Warcraft. The Lord of <laughs> from Blizzard. Handcrafted original concepts. <laughs> Booty. From Compulsion Games. And blockbuster games with massive audiences like Call of Duty, Black Ops 6 from Activision. On behalf of our creative teams at Activision, Bethesda, Blizzard, King, and Xbox Game Studios, Dang. we thank you for your continued Wasn't that support. The, were that the people who made Candy Crush? Vicious games in your hands. Diablo is one of the most oh shit. Series Diablo, the thing that they we're fucked up. To have Diablo 4 in Game Pass, where millions of you oh. made it your favorite way to play. Oh, yeah. This October, oh. Diablo 4. <laughs> I love people just favorite, spamming L and W. <laughs> experience with an all new character class, a new region, and 40 minutes. And course, the next chapter in the acclaimed story. Here is the opening cinematic for the game. Let's take a look. Let's take oh a look. Oh, my gosh. This is more like a bathroom break for me. Contains graphic content. Oh man, he might be Satan. Oh man. Oh God, Jesus, Jesus, I'm running to me, Jesus, me. Ah, look at that guy. That guy's fucking muscular. Oh God, the fish are dead. Is that a soul gem? Oh God. Boy, young one. And she's swung like crazy. Oh no, she's getting infected. Oh no, oh no. She gonna eat it? Yeah, look it. Oh god. Is that how I raised you? Oh no, mother. That's her mom, what the hell? But I must carry this burden alone. I must get to Akarat's tomb. Oh God! Look at you. You're Who's killing tomb? yourself. You're killing yourself, Christopher. I, I don't know. 
I'm watching this. Yes, we all know this is your dream. To be part of the Xbox Showcase. To be part of Game Pass. <laughs> You're so stupid. I'm so I gotta help Phil. You. <laughs> so, instead of buying the Game Pass, you become part of the Game Pass. Yeah, it's the next step up. Oh, what the? Ew, what the? Oh. oh, God. Oh, God. Oh. Ew, magpie. No, she said my my, my little eggplant. Oh. God, look what they're doing to her. God, Diablo always does this so well. Surrender. All right, bathroom break. God, look at her fucking arms. Oh my god. Oh, that looks terrible. Where the fuck did her hand go? Maybe you're right. Where's the Maybe guy? Could use some help. Oh no. Oh my god, it went through his chest! <laughs> oh my god, they're infecting everything, everything's dying! Ew! Just to do that with one hand. She's not giving up. Ah, uh, the eternal battle of heaven and hell, man. It just never stops. I actually like that so much, man. Diablo always does their cinematics so good. That was good. That was pretty good. Oh my god. Xbox Game Studio Is presents. it over? Yeah, it was, re it was really good. I actually like that one. Uh, uh, it visually looked nice, but... Oh! Gears? So... Playground games? You want to know all about heroes, dear? Well, you have come to the right place. Game of Thrones? Because, uh, who better to tell you all about them than perhaps the greatest... Ew! Is that based yeah. off some real-life guy? I feel like he looks like a real-life guy. It's Sir yeah. Hawkinsmith. Oh. Really let himself go. <laughs> oh, Fable. Fable? I mean, that's just somebody hey, wrote in the chat. You know. I'm free. Oh yeah, I'll be. Yup, yeah, it's Fable. It's Albion. Retired. I mean, sure. Wow, this looks good. Oh, the frames look a little bad, right? I think the lighting is a little too bright. <laughs> I think you know. I said this before. I'll say it again. I think Fable is more of a 2008 game, 2010s game. I feel like today, the the way the style of the game is, the humor and everything, I don't think it really is the same era. Like, the type of comedy definitely isn't modern-day comedy anymore, I feel like. I feel like this is a famous actor. Like, they modeled the face after the famous actor. I forgot who. Nowhere else to go. Welcome to the most exclusive club in all of Albion. Damn. Get her out there. Make the most of her gift. But you know what it's like when you're young and you have a point to prove. Oh God. Oh. This kid, she had it all. The skill. Oh wow. Talent. Yeah, power. She was something else, all right. Oh God. Terrifying. So, yeah, I knew this girl once who made all the wrong choices. Oh. Humphrey. She's back. Oh, uh, 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 uh. Yeah, Humphrey's talking shit, huh? I'm late. I'm going to fix it, this place. 
and no one is going to stand yeah, in Humphrey's my way. Humphrey's going with it. Humphrey looks like a clown. Okay, not too bad. I like I liked what they showed with Fable. Uh, another ten years to play this game. Oh. Uh, what I don't understand is they're just calling it Fable. Like, how are we going to differentiate between Fable yeah, and Yeah, I was Fable thinking the one? same thing. I hate when All they right. do that shit. World premiere. Oh, fuck. World premiere. Mar Marcus Phoenix Collection. No, oh, no. It's too technical. Wait, Valorant? Is this Valorant? Use this. No. No. Is this uh the stupid fucking nude stupid game that came out a while ago? Um... I don't know what it's called. Oh my god. It's like an FPS though. Uh that yeah, doesn't fucking matter. Alright, I'm gonna go take a piss. What the hell is this? It looks like it's copying Valorant. Almost. What the hell? That doesn't look that bad actually. Yeah, it looks interesting. Oh. I know she was not hiding in that grass. Ew, big head. This, this looks a little bit too arcadey. Rule changing hero shooter, huh? Frag punk. Looks like a game that might die in three months. World premiere. Looks like a very gimmicky game, but. Noodle cake. What the fuck? The tale of Desperado? Definitely a bathroom break. Left what did you do before? I thought you already went to the bathroom. I, I went to my kitchen to like throw everything, put some stuff away, and then like I came back and the oh, thing trailer ended. Yeah, yeah, you better hurry. This looks like shit. I'll tell you what you miss. Taking good care of it. The bridge to her house is broken, so I can't even ask her. Like, what the hell is this? Home again. No matter what, <laughs> what the hell? It's like, don't starve. No matter how hard it gets. What the fuck? I fight. And find meaning and beauty out here. See, I feel like the, the appeal for this game is like, you get to play as a cute mouse and stuff. Because again, now what I always do is I compare it to other games. Like, why would you play this over the ones that already are established and do it better? The only reason I can see you play this is is the graphics. Like you like the theme, you like the uh, the mouses. You're a furry. Oh my god! And we're also seeing nature. Wow, winter burrow. What the fuck? World premiere. World premiere. I wonder how long they're gonna go because they're going non stop. My mixtapes bend others to my will. Oh, shit, and a perna? Almost cosmic talent. Go back to this shit also looks low frame rate. When friendships were <laughs> this looks like the stupid Bayou game, the freaking southern game. What the hell? This looks so what the hell did I walk back to? Another low frame rate piece of shit. From Beethoven and Dinosaur. It's an apparent Be Beethoven and Dinosaur. Oh my god, like, look at the fucking frames they have. It's like fucking so oh god. It's very it Spider-Man. If you're into like games like Life is Strange, you probably would love this. It looks like a Life is Strange sort of game. I'm so pregnant. Wow. Set to the soundtrack. You know, it's crazy. It actually doesn't look that bad. I feel like this is a game more for, you know, I might get like a little flack this, but more for like girls. I, feel like I girls think girls. Love this game. I think it's more like a. Are we gonna think of ourselves in ten years? Uh, I don't even know, actually. I'll just remember to tell myself it felt important at the time. Like this is a very, very big story game, obviously. You're invited to go back. In what the fuck? <laughs> I swear, it looks like a fucking Life is Strange game. Okay. It's for young people, people who are like angsty teens who want to feel like they're cool and don't want to grow up. There you go. That's the game. Alright, here we go. 
All right, it's almost one. There's no way this showcase goes on for an hour and a half. Yeah, because they're not stop showing shit. Like, they barely talk, which I like. Not wasting time, they're just showing shit. The Coalition. Nah, nah, it's a Sobo, Sobo. Oh, okay, okay, I say Ebo. They made a Dobo. Powered by satellite data in Azuria. Oh my god, is this fucking flying simulator? Very popular though. Yeah, I mean, I, I have people use it to like actually like train for jobs and shit. That's pretty cool. Yeah. But you would even question is it a fucking game? Think about that. Do you think it was made as a game first, or do you think it was made as an actual like training thing for people, and then they just said, hey, why don't we sell it as a game? It's a good question. Because they make this shit hyper realistic. The game visually looks amazing. Oh, you could be an air ambulance. Look, you could do a job. You could do a real life job. Aerial advertising. Wow. Yo, don't tell Mark Zuckerberg. He might hire you in the metaverse. He might. He might make you a VIP charter service. You think we're, we're gonna have metaverse terrorism? <laughs> I'm just waiting for it. AI to get into the game where they can just generate oh, worlds. Yeah, it'd be cool. Random ass fucking worlds. They already have Azure AI in this somehow. We don't know how, but it's in here. Apparently, also NVIDIA is making AI uh, in games too. They said they're making AI and um, they're they're inputting it into what the fuck is that stupid caveman game? Us uh, uh, Ark. <laughs> oh, how again? I don't know the details, but AI is in games at this point. Coming, it's in. Oh, look, it's Jesus! Hi, Jesus! Jesus Where's wants a hug. Jesus! Say hello, Jesus! Well, that's a little dangerous. Whoa. Oh my god, the hot air balloon. This gate, like, if this is all in game graphics, this looks insane. If you're old, you're retired, you don't know what the fuck to do, just play this. You just go explore the world if you're, like, poor. <laughs> you can go wherever you want. Wow, this looks crazy. You could do jobs too. You still want to work, but you can't. You're disabled. Go play Flight Simulator. You could save people. You could charter people. You could taxi people. You could send Phil Spencer a game pass. You could do whatever you want. Oh my god, this shit's still out? What the hell? Wow. Be an Argonian, look at that. I remember we were in the city at one point, me and you. She's still going. <laughs> oh my god, the giant! Oh no. Oh, I actually killed it, wow. I like this song, this song is funny. <laughs> Look at get away from me, get away from me. Ew, what the hell? Oh my god, it smacked him. Looks like winter hold. Explore, wow. Huh. Wow. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Oh, look, we're in Tamriel. <laughs> this looks so stupid. <laughs> oh god, that guy's like riding a spider. Oh wow, look, you can play all the DLC for free, wow. Huh, look at that. For a limited time only, damn. Someone said in the chat who made this shit. <laughs> <laughs> they said screw you, Bethesda. <laughs> they hate it. What the fuck is this shit? <laughs> I found my friend's body. 
in the woods. Oh no. I wanted to say something so bad, but I feel like I'm gonna get cancelled. I don't know who I can trust. <laughs> or if trust what the me. hell? You know what this kind of reminds me of? Um, you know the game The Quarry? Yeah. It reminds me of that. Oh great, look, life is strange. Oh boy. Can I still hear her voice? Oh boy. Okay, cool. At least it's not too realistic. It's like... A little bit fantasy-like, I guess. Oh, whoa. Whoa! Sophie is still alive. The danger stalks are every step. That almost reminds me of the quarry, but more cartoon-looking. The quarry had, like, more realistic graphics. Parallel world? It's the same as this one, except... You're dead. You're... Dead. Whoa! I can still save Sophie. Not Sophie. I can solve we gotta find who the killer is. Thing. Yeah. The same murder. Wow. The new Oh, it's Max Call Oh, it is Life is Strange still. Damn, I thought it was just completely new. Wow. Okay, damn. There it is. And there it is. The life is really strange. Oh shit, but that's the Skyrim? Skyrim? The scrolls? What the fuck? Oh, it's Star Wars. What? Huh? Are you sure you want to investigate these Hindi? I can't let this go. It could be the best kept secret in history. Is this Star Wars? Wait, it's Indiana Jones. Indiana. What? You know, I had no clue Lucasfilm was a part of that. Deep wow. connection to something in the past. Boss believes they hold a kind of power. What the fuck? Discovery that could change the world. Well, do you like Indiana Jones? What are you doing out there? Okay, I mean, I actually think we're getting towards the end now. Because. Well, what about Indiana Jones? Or they will. Hey, he's Indiana. He's Indian. If you were to draw a line through these. Uh, this is one of the games that people have been waiting for to talk about. I think it's too late, personally, but exactly. I intercepted the Morse uh, coming from the Himalayas. Where Voss is sending all of his men. This is based on the movie. Is this based on the movie or is this like its own a... story? Battleship? I never saw yep. Deanna Jones, I wouldn't fucking know. Let's get a closer look. <laughs> Gotta find a stone and get off this ship. What's that in his hands? What does it say? Taser? Oh. What's that? We'd better hide. He's still trying to grab it. Ah, they just fucking broke it out. Ciao. Hey. Oh. Graphics for this game are really good, holy shit. Oh no, are they... Are they the Germans? Oh no, they're the Germans. Where's the stone? You American rat? You American rat? Have you ever heard of Höhenangst? Fear of heights? Yes! And I have it. I endured this dreadful mountain even if my mind was screaming every step of the way. Oh my. Because of a concept, you narrow minded Americans will never understand. <laughs> Just keep beating him. Devotion. Total and absolute devotion to the fatherland. Oh my god. You have no purpose. What you have is your stupid American cartoons. What? <laughs> choo, 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 choo. They better not learn about the Japanese. <laughs> Yo, he's like, they're right. You laugh and dance, celebrating your own idiocy and drinking the piss you call beer. Oh my god. I will walk through fire for the How are they bits. not seeing her? They look, they stand out. Now. 
Can't give you what I don't have. So kill him if he doesn't have it. I shall search your corpse to make sure. Place away. Give me the stone. You know. It's probably a fucking fake stone. It's probably like a snowstone. Wow. <laughs> She's doing silly shit. Like, oh, okay, this is so dumb, bro. This has to be like movie inspired. Oh my god. This is so stupid. <laughs> he just tossed his ass off. What is that soldier doing? <laughs> They're like freaking stupid. Like he's like, oh. <laughs> wow. This really is like, it feels like it was made for like a movie. Bruh. Yeah, yeah, look, oh yeah. Yeah, get his ass out of here, too. Take this nonsense off. Yeah, why are they spending so much time on this? They love Indiana Jones, man. Oh my god. He threw a fuck. He threw a sledgehammer at him. Oh my god. First person, look at that, wow. <laughs> So is this the is the way Indiana Jones looks here like Harrison Ford's one? Yeah. Yeah. Is he the only one who did Indiana Jones? He's the only one who did Indiana Jones. Is your question? Yeah. Um, I I'm not too sure. It's a good question. If he's the only actor who ever played Indiana Jones. Yeah. Look, play it day one. Fight the German soldiers day one with Phil Spencer's Game Pass. What the fuck is this? What the Gundam? It does look like Gundam. What the hell? Well, it's not good. I'm sure you sure this isn't Pacific Rim. Oh, this is Transformers. Ah, the movement <laughs> for this shit looks too much. Uh, that shit looks cool as fuck. I don't know. This looks too like. Like, this game, I, I can tell you why this game's gonna die. It's not casual. This game is too for the pros. Like, the fact that you can move like that, people are going to eat other people alive in this game. Looks cool as shit, though, I'm not gonna lie, but, like, it does not look like it could be fun if you're not good at games. That's why this game will not survive, I don't think. If it doesn't. But who knows, maybe there's a dedicated enough player base to where, you know, they're serious and, and they're whales, who knows. Like, look at this shit, what the hell? Like, this shit looks crazy. What the fuck? The look, it's probably getting hard right now, he saw this. Oh Dude, my god. It's not multiplayer. It has to be multiplayer. There's no way this would be single player. There's no way. Maybe you're right, I don't even know. Mecha break. Wow. They spend 10 minutes on Indiana Jones, but one minute on this. Like, the fuck? Oh my god, what the hell is this? You Ew. Never know you are a monster. They didn't even announce anything for Overwatch. Until they just killed him. Yeah, they didn't. You. I mean, they don't really need to. I'll watch those the his own shit. Ew. But over time, it becomes clear. Is that Laura Croft? What is that? You, slowly Wait, no, it's not Laura Croft. Croft. Yeah. Of your humanity. The hell? Ew, what the hell? I doubt it's Blade and Soul, right? Naraka? I doubt it's Naraka. I doubt it's Blade and Soul. Wow, I just slapped her. What a loser. You think this is Strider? No way. The new, it's the new, uh, Ryu Hayabusa. I mean, this looks cool. Looks... Yeah, it does. It looks pretty cool. It has a hot female pro tag, too, so you know, that's a plus. The graphic style is really nice. I like the, the colors and everything. It almost reminds me of Sekiro. 
Kind of reminds me of Sekiro. It runs in my blood. If if fucking uh from software made this, I think this game would be fucking amazing. Nothing is forever. Wu Chang. That looks pretty cool. That one, that one looked nice. That one looked pretty cool. A lot of people are saying W with that one. Oh yeah. Game Pass W. Fuck is this? Has chosen you as our envoy to the living lands. What the hell? The wild frontier suffers from the dream scourge. Uh, the root of this terrible plague. This almost has every single theme we've seen so far, except space. It has fantasy zombies. The dream scourge end of apocalypse, but not really. But dangerous rot. It only doesn't have space. That's it. Go, Ew. The chaos that plagues the is this Baldur's Gate? What is this? Standing can shape its future. Is this Baldur's Gate? What the we fuck? Deceive you. There is more wonder in this world than eyes alone can see. What the hell? You must open yourself to its mysteries. This could be. Oh wait, no, never mind. It's first person. Purpose, no matter how wild. What the fuck is this? Become what the living lands truly needs. Its protector. Choose your side. Are you good or are you evil and not gonna buy the fucking game pass? Thank God. Oh wow, of vowed. Huh. That looks interesting, I guess. Did we see blob sticks. Uh they showed in the beginning, but they didn't really show anything yet. They said they're gonna show stuff like later on. So no spoilies, Hunter. As you often do. Like you already just spoiled. This is the premier spoiler, Hunty. Fuck you watching, Michelle. I mean, I'm just waiting for this shit to get fucking good. Oh, look, Wait, look, what? good, look. Oh my gosh, bruh. Is this Wolfenstein? What is this? Ha <laughs> 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 More and more, I'm just, I, I think I've already essentially given up on Xbox, so I'm just clinging on to a little bit of hope. I just think for me it's just games in general. Like, I feel like I've experienced most of what they have to offer, and a lot of them are just too. I guess similar. Uh. Ew! How <laughs> was that? This almost looks like it's trying to be Wolfenstein. The graphics, are, the graphics are cool. What the hell is this? Well, I like that we're getting new titles. Yeah, I like that. Not like number five, six, seven of an existing game series. I like that it's new. I hope they don't show Forza. I just saw in the chat Forza. I hope they don't show Forza. What the hell? This shit's gonna go on till two thirty. No fucking way. Why my bones ache in the weather? War. Wow. Is it Assassin's Creed? Yeah, wow. This is Assassin's Creed. Wow. So rather that both both of the characters are LGBTQ. Wait, what in an Assassin's Creed? Yeah, this one. Oh this is Assassin's Creed. I didn't even know there was two, wow. Yeah, it's um the, bl the black samurai, I think. To be freed of the Got his name. Um. Vengeance is on lonely paths now. Isuke? I, I think so. There are other ways to heal. Yasuke? Oh my god, he just tackled that shit. Yeah, look, wow. Abuse their power. Do not deserve to keep it. The black samurai, look at that. Like that, he just stomped on the ground. Yo, look at him, it's from Netflix. You 
How will the big black guy, gay samurai do that? Wait, he was gay? That's crazy. He's like breaking like every like he, like he's completely going against the norms of like that thing. Like he's black in Japanese society in the past, and he's gay. Like that's so crazy. Back to the people. Assassin's Creed Shadows. Wow. Cool name. The first thing I thought of when you said they're LGBT, I thought like it was a double like female main character thing. Wait, this was made in Ukraine. What the hell? How did they make this? Ukraine's getting bombed. Oh. Gears? No, I think this could be um This looks like uh Metro. Could be Metro. It'll be a while before we get a new Metro game too. Hey, look at his head. I like the graphics of this game. This really looks like, like Metro. What the hell is that? Does he not see that? What the fuck is this? Oh my god. What is this, Chernobyl? Those dogs are like turning into feathers. It's bloated. What the hell? Wow. Oh, fuck a mob. That guy's dying. Look at that bubble. Ooh. Putting on the silencer, covert ops, here we go, solid snake, naked snake, what the, what the hell? I feel like they've showed this game already, actually. This is a new one, I feel like they showed this. Oh, he stabbed him. Oh, god, ah. Oh. I feel like this isn't new, I feel like they showed this. Oh my god, what is that thing? He lit his ass up. Why did he need the scanner for that? Could you not see that? This is ass? I actually think it's okay. Yeah, Stalker 2, they did show this before. They did show this. This is not- I feel like they've been showing this for so fucking long. It's about to come out in September, so... Hopefully we won't see it too much anymore. We've been honored to partner with GSC Game World, the Ukrainian this lady, I think. studio behind Stalker 2. We can't wait for you to experience their game it's a little robotic today. on September 5th. Today, <laughs> shaking her head. People like Stalker too. Around the world. Yeah, no, it looks, it looks interesting. I think it looks okay. Our own studios. All right, here we go. The ending. To original independent games. I hope you enjoy the breadth of titles coming to Xbox. She looks like she does not touch games. In addition games. to all these great games, we're introducing a new all digital series X and expanding oh. color and storage options. One terabyte the is terrible line. nowadays. That They'll is a terrible standard. See, two terabytes is better, but look, you can get it in Galaxy Black. Wow, it has green dots. Family, <laughs> wow. Choices. It's our mission to make Xbox the best place for you to play by including the titles from our own studios and Game Pass at launch, by bringing your games into the future. He has really big hands. By pushing the technical she's pretty. boundaries in our future hardware. Yeah, and I don't know. I feel like she's pretty, but she's acting weird. Anywhere you want on Xbox. Consoles, I think they replaced her with AI. This oh. is what you know what I think happened? I don't think she the bought future. the Game Pass, so Phil had to deal with her. On the next generation. I think she's a message for ends, everyone who doesn't buy Game Pass. Black Ops 6 Direct begins. We're taking you inside Treyarch and Raven for an extended Whoa. look at what's next in Black Ops. 
But what the hell? Before we dive into the garage, I think it look like we that. Here we go. One more thing. Here we go. Oh, here it is. It's the red. It's red. You know what we're it's here red. for. They saved the. Yup, Xbox oh, Games says everything's it coming. Be. It has to be. Marcus Phoenix. Marcus yeah, Phoenix. Is. War, War is over. over. Look, they won. Oh yeah, there it is. That's the cog. We saw the berserkers coming. The berserker. Oh god, it. Was... Yeah, it's probably oh. the collection. <laughs> oh god, it punched him. No way. No way. Tell us Marcus Phoenix. Oh no, get back here. No collection for you. Find me in. This is what I've been waiting for. Michelle, they're making sure Marcus Phoenix doesn't come back for the collection. Look. The fact that a regular grunt is beating him is insane. He's gonna beat him with the TV. Oh god. He's really having trouble with this. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yo, this is the Gears collection. Oh, wait, what? It's Marcus, right? That's it. Is that supposed to be Dom? J JD, maybe? Maybe JD. Oh, that's not the collection. Oh my god, he shut his head off. It's the Retro Lancer, apparently, yeah. Huh. Is that JD? That might be JD. What the fuck? Oh my god, he just won. Is they young Marcus? Are they going no, That's right? it. Oh, oh, wait a minute, Michelle, who is it? Yeah, wait, that, that is oh, Marcus. It's young Marcus! Yeah. They're going back in time, I think. Didn't they already do that with one of them? No, this I think this is the pendulum more. Oh. oh or maybe not, because that that. Yo, Dom looked like a monkey. What give the Give me the hell? Gears of War collection, Is this please. right when it happened? Please, give me the Gears of War collection. Gears Is this like War. right when it started? E-Day, oh, wow, oh, yeah. Right, yeah, they're going back in back in the day. No Marcus Phoenix collection. Yeah, I know. I'm honestly happy they don't do that because they might fuck it up. I'd rather it remain like pristine than them redoing it and then fo possibly fucking it up. So that, that was it. Yeah, now we're doing the Black Ops thing. I mean, I, I want to do this. I definitely want to see the zombies in the multiplayer, because I'm still, I'm thinking about getting sick, but we'll see. I, I'm like a diehard zombies fan. Despite what Cold War did and what they did after Cold War, which we won't even talk about because it's so terrible. I'm, I'm always keeping my eye out. Marcus is hot. Oh my God. <laughs> Dom and Marcus had a kid. Shut up. Marcus is hot. I, I do not want to watch this bullshit. You don't have to. I mean, I could, I could I, just. Yeah, I do have to dip out anyway. Yeah, I'll I'll, I'll right. stay for this one. But anyway, oh wait, dip Black Ops one? Yeah, of course. Oh, the moon, the moon shit. And thanks for joining us today. It's the fucking uh, Zat. Or, oh my Black god, what was the Wonder Weapon called on Moon? Black Ops Six. We really wanted to give uh, time to craft the Zap gun, right? Is that, this no, means we're delivering was the a new. Was that the, the, the wave gun? Wave gun? Yeah. yeah. I've been working here for over 20 years, and I can tell you that we Oh, have... the Wonder Wolf! I know that the team are excited to give you a deep dive into... Yeah, the Zap guns were the broken apart ones. Yeah, I knew I, I knew it was, yeah. What the hell? If you have to dip out, what is your, uh... What do you think, just real quick, on the the whole conference so far? Uh... That was like, okay. I, it wasn't it was the best all, It was alright. But, like... I mean, like, I'm excited for E-Day. But, like, at the same time... I wanted my Gears collection. I'm a little happy if they don't do it, honestly. If they, because they might fuck it up. You know what I like about the old Gears, the Gears 1, Gears 2? The visuals looked gritty. Like, they really, really had, like, the visual style very dark and depressing back then. Like, Gears 1 looks very, like... Of that era the team has been meticulously looks good though every aspect of this game in terms of like the uh the, the theme and the emotions they want to let's say i think it's really good but they're playing multiplayer here and brings the black ops style and provides a playground for the I feel like i've seen miles leslie a lot system. before new way to push beyond your this guy looks like a chad like an action hero whoa you could move like an action hero whoa. oh here we go here we go here we go round based round based with that 
Let's step into please the mind please. campaign experience. We've been crying. Bro, oh, no one cares about campaign. Oh my god. Well, they confirm round base zombies. Thank fucking god. If they didn't do that, I'd be sad. But... No turning back now. What's the SWAT? What the hell? Wow, campaign. Has a campaign Raven. Raven? Ew. We were focused on delivering missions so iconic that they stick in your memory long after. Yeah, 9-11. We're bringing <laughs> an action-packed blockbuster feel to every step of the narrative. I still remember Black we're Ops 1 campaign variety, to this day, so... I don't know, again, it could have just been because I was... Hey, look, the chopper gunner. It could have just been because I was a kid, sure. It was like, you know, then. Like, I remember stuff back then a lot easier, but... I feel like Black Ops almost like The game is man. packed with unexpected moments of Black Ops mystery. It's a Whoa. high octane spy thriller where you're never sure who to trust and what's real. Just like Cold War. Cold War was pretty good too. Cold War campaign wasn't bad. The Soviet either. Union was crumbling after the fall of the Berlin It was a little short the though, but. The, the U.S. is the only remaining superpower. The Gulf War was dominating headlines everywhere. Wow. There was a growing mistrust in government reflected everywhere. There already is a growing mistrust in government. It grew. It had a baby. Phil Spencer. When we talk about the Black Ops timeline, Black Ops 6 comes after the events of the Cold War, but is directly Obviously. tied to the 1986 flashbacks in Black Ops 2. The aftermath oh. which has left our heroes... I forgot Black Ops 3 was in, like, the future. Jesus Christ, man. Some you should see. Yeah, look at Woods. He's still here. He could get up, too. He's just lazy. ...history of previous franchise titles with bold new characters. With veteran Frank Woods as our through line in our story. Wow. I remember the VA for the original Frank Woods doesn't like what they did with like him in the story. He very much doesn't like it. He's been pulled from the field as he adjusts to a new role within the CIA, often behind a desk or on the other end of a radio. Look at him. His protege is Troy Marshall, who's been making more Menendez rage mode. Yeah, that shit was funny. Leader driven by a strong moral compass. Marshall and Woods are working. Sounds like they're trying to like tell us a movie. CIA it's basically what Black Ops is. Oh! She's a born leader, fearless and brilliant, and helps manage their relationships within this the... This girl game. looking like Phil Spencer a little bit. She got Woods a little bit of the game pass in her. Shadows has always been hugely valuable to the CIA, whether they want to admit it or not. Oh, they don't want to admit it. make tough calls in the field, ones that Harrow trusts him to make. But when an operation goes wrong, Woods and Marshall are suspended and ultimately forced to go rogue. Wow. They soon realize they have to trust each other to get to the bottom of what's going Two on. Two men betrayed by their country. Without any of their usual resources, they have to build wow. their own team, recruiting two exciting new characters in Dr. Park's Dr. Park zombie genius. sex scene. Nah, the one thing that, you know, and I always mention this, and you know this too, Hunter. Like, the biggest thing that's bad with zombies the is they let operators in. There's no more, like, unique characters. Powers. And with the sudden That's return sad of part. notorious operative Russell Adler, who'd gone missing for months, wow, that looked former real. Ally may have become a new enemy. Oh no! Now nah, Adler is very like loyal. There's no the way. Black Ops single player campaign. We no prioritized way. mission variety and unique experiences. They Our say the same the shit every year. Types, each crafted from the ground up. Every One moment, fucking you'll be year. A the next. You'll be pulling off a heist I wonder how many years need to go by where they just can't make a new COD campaign. It's like they've ran out of ideas. We went to the past, we went to the future, I guess we're doing 9-11 soon, who knows. Like, in 10 years, where's the Black Ops campaign gonna go to? You think we're getting a crew from the rumors? I hope so. Some of these campaign maps are obviously multiplayer maps. Ew, what the hell? It looks so ugly. It looks like a politician. Ew, you're waiting through the fucking sewers. Oh. The graphics always look good, though, at least. Like, the graphics for COD campaigns, it's no wonder this thing does so well. It's like, you could just be a regular person and enjoy that shit. We are excited to offer a variety of different enemy types in the campaign. <laughs> the goal was to provide different channels. Oh, look, the player. Juggernaut. Dude, when they added the Juggernaut in, like, MW3, that them. was so hyped. Now it's just overused. It's like, who cares? But these aren't the zombies maps. I mean, listen, every zombies map they use campaign shit. Like, come on. Let's be real. I hope it just isn't as obvious as uh, War. But every zombie map is like re, you know, reuse campaign assets. Let's be real. Just how bad, how good can they hide it? Certain missions where we give you a high level objective. In a variety of ways to approach that objective. Wow, they always give you freedom, your choice, your way. Wow. 
You and your team are hunting down missile launchers with the SAS. It's one of the largest campaign maps that we've ever created. Look alive, people! They know we're coming! Oh, man. I bring back Woods, man. Where's Mason? Where's Alex Mason? I'm gonna give this one more minute, and if not... Because it's terrible. Have a startling contrast like spray. In he well. sprays. He does not aim. We have a mission that takes place Here's a war E day. Casino in southern Europe. It's oh I just hope it plays. I just hope it plays like the other gears. What a player yeah. does in this space is totally unexpected. In another one of our missions, we have set in the harsh tundra of northern Russia. That looks like a fucking Black Ops One map. Oh, is that the, that's the M16. Oh we shit! Are to offer an array of brand and I miss Cod. As well as some favorites from the Black Ops universe. RC car. Tranquilizer trap. I don't remember Dreadful that stem. shit. A stem? I guess that's in Cold War. Oh my! Oh my! What the? <laughs> he has a fucking RC car, yeah. Oh. Multiplayer? The is grounded within oh an expanded God. campaign hub called the Safe House. This is another lady who looks like she hasn't ever touched video Black games in her life. But this time, we wanted to think a little bit more broadly about the environment. We chose to have our team's hub located in This is the same shit they did in Cold setting. War. They're just so, doing it again. It's in an abandoned Instead of a fucking garage, we're in a fucking side. mansion. Yay, we upgraded. Whoopee. What's most unique is that it used to be a KGB black site, which was operational during the 50s and 60s. Oh, man. This brings a lot of intrigue to the safe house. And like Cold War again? Yeah, it kind of is, yeah. Same thing they did in Cold War. Secrets from the, past. the team is also bringing back the evidence board. Oh, God, not this crap. Experience, but with brand new upgrades. Oh, Players I hope so. The campaign outline, gain deeper insights into missions, and analyze evidence collected throughout missions. Yeah, look, what's is gonna see it while on his wheelchair? Okay. Oh my god. Okay, the attacker comes in. I'll go. Three, two, one. Oh go. my god. Damn, the fact that a person could do that to another that person sick. is insane. I think we got it. Yeah, I think we got it. Oh yeah. Omni our movement. Is, our goal is to create a more connected experience. This is gonna be a multiplayer and zombies. Every single that looked like multiplayer. Reminds you of Dokes from Dexter. A little bit. Corner to innovate and craft the most wow. Black Ops experience for our players. <laughs> that guy got fucked up. Movement has been a consistent area of focus and innovation for Call of Duty. And with Black Ops 6, Who the fuck would actually use this? I want to see how useless this, or useful this actually is. For the first time ever, players can sprint in any direction and move like a true Black Ops action hero. That is crazy. Wow. System we call Omni movement. What the hell? This unlocks the ability to move like never before. You could sprint in like any slide, direction. Dive, and our enhanced supine prone in full Yo, look at that ass. Holy motion. shit. I don't know if that's a guy or not. From the beginning, we started with, you can't do this thing. Why? And then Why? Why? Because it's toxic. It doesn't make sense. You just walk back. And then instantly it opened up like, oh, if you can sprint in any direction, then you can dive in any direction. You could slide in any direction. Well, yeah, Which that's the next like, logical you, step, of course. Ground yeah. movement and everything else chaining together. Yeah, oh, <laughs> hey, good luck balancing this. I mean, realistically, what, what balance does this need? Like, you know, I don't feel like this is a fucking issue. It's really been something that changes how you think and play the game. I really feel like they're jacking it harder zombies. than it is. We truly believe. So show us zombies, man. Movement, show us zombies, no please. So when they say there's no going back, I wonder if this is gonna be like the new standard for every Call of Duty now. Probably has to be. Yo, look, they want zombies. The chat wants zombies. We also have what we're calling intelligent movement. Which is a set of features uh -huh. that drastically reduces how many buttons or keys you're pressing to perform various movements. These what? can be enabled in player options, and they're broken down into three categories. What? Sprint assist, mantle assist, and crouch assist. Oh? And each of these settings... Oh, wow. Fine -tuning. It's playing the game for you Intelligent almost. Wow. Really started with this idea that we want all players to focus on what they want to do and not how to This do is it. so lazy. Like I don't we understand why they're doing this. Skill level or input or Skill level. Yeah, so they'll yeah, automatically so sprint design. and mantle for you. What? What? We looked at other genres like racing games where they have these great assist settings that can be turned on and off. 
Things like yeah. traction control or assisted braking. And we really love the idea of taking that thing. I just want to put this out here. Cold War I don't think this had is worse car mechanics than Fortnite. A paid AAA to really game had worse car system. mechanics than Fortnite. Both are kind of like shooters, by the way. You can have flop, or at least we have that. Yeah, I hope so. I hope they bring flop, flopper back. Hopefully. What does that matter? Oh, for the animation. Oh my god, he got fucked up! Nah, that's funny as shit. That looks funny. I think the animations with like people just ragdolling that hard, like if you get shot, you just fly back. That is funny. Dived in the water. Yeah. As you round a corner, go through a doorway. Your weapon's gonna dynamically rotate in the direction that you're rounding that corner. And since it's dynamic, it'll be a bit more dramatic if you're slowly clearing a room. Oh, that's kind of cool. Barreling full speed around that same corner. Okay, I kind of like that. Looking for opportunities to set the bar. These are like little tidbits that are cool, I guess. Yeah, this is nice. Oh, the juggernaut, bitch. Take cover. Take cover, and he's in the middle of the fucking room. Team is super thrilled to show you the best looking characters that we've done. Yo, uh, zombies, you bitch. That guy is fucking bull. Wow. All right, I'm out of here. See you later. Right, onto each of our operatives. For our faces. A dynamic real-time analysis of spontaneous okay. performances was so it's a solo show from here but we're fine with emotional that. impactful moment true to actual life my god we made sure to have special attention to the cuticles and make sure that the cuticles the now the graphics do look nice i'm not gonna lie the graphics look really good but these are a new standard now like graphics don't impress us anymore really like not like they used to oh attention every detail zombie zombo I hate how they're just giving us little like teases, little tidbits, man. I'm most excited about is the Maxwell Porter? We've added, which Porter's Mark II Raygun? Our heroes are rogue operatives and they operate outside the normal playbook. That means they're procuring gear by any means necessary. Whoa. And that allowed us to pull a unique mix of weapons. We made sure that red dot looks cool. Now the graphics look really good though, but again, this is like the uh, the standard. But they look good. They only showed us a zombie's dick. I want to see the map. <laughs> In Black Ops 6, we really strive. Yeah, it's Mike Chubb. Oh my gosh, is that woods in the background. Real, but we want to ground our effects in realism. We find real it's pretty cool. I mean, these are all things that don't really matter at the end of the day. They're nice to know, but it's like then rip off of that. These are additions to the core. The core better be good. These are the additions. And see the trailer for drop in. I didn't. The first thing I'm looking at today is this thing. What the fuck was that? Oh, the HUD, here we go. The Black Ops 6 user experience is all about focusing players on what they need, when they need it. And our in-game HUD is no UI different. UX director. From the map to the ammo widget to in-game notifications, the Black It looks Ops like almost nothing has changed. Designs and a clean, streamlined experience. It looks like nearly nothing has changed. This guy's For just collecting a check. Call of Duty, players will be able to change their HUD in dramatic ways to suit their needs. Oh, finally. Instance, okay, cool. Streamers can choose a layout optimized for their setup. Oh, okay, that's actually really good. That helps me because I have my overlay on the right. That's actually really good. Or finally put the mini map in the bottom left. Those are options as well. Cool. That's pretty good. Nice. Players important status. It connects them to the world and helps them feel rewarded for being awesome. As players track that elusive challenge or target their next level unlock, Black Ops 6 offers an end-to-end experience from the lobby into combat and back, where player progress and achievement are celebrated in a big way. Big way. Quick play. Alright, okay, right, he's getting ready. Alright, let's see. Progression. Early on in Black Ops 6's development, we set a goal to make leveling and XP matter more than ever. Looking more than ever. How do they make it matter more than, more than ever? There's a lot of love, both internally at Treyarch. Prestige is all people care about. For how we used to handle prestige oh, there it is look they said it they said it it's the only thing that matters prestige, prestige. Is back in call of duty with black ops 6. okay we the best of the best from past call of duty prestige systems and are going bigger and more rewarding than ever players who reach max player level will have the choice to enter prestige 
Start fresh with relocked gear. Nice. And go through the leveling journey again. Okay. Black Ops 6 will have 10 prestiges, each with a and valuable then, set of oh. rewards to earn and equip. The prestige back in the day was so, like, they came with so much clout. Prestige 10 aren't done. Instead, Wait, we're not we'll done at 10? Into prestige master with a thousand additional levels to climb through. This is basically and just like Black Ops fucking 3 again. For anyone dedicated this legit looks like Black Ops 3. The full prestige system is available on day one in Black Ops 6. Why wouldn't it be available day one? What the hell? Like what, do we have to wait for DLC for that usually? What? What the hell? They say that, that, that that's like a good thing. That was the standard. We're providing a deep dive on it later in the year. For now, here's some insight into our development of Black Ops. That looks like an egg. Our vision since day one has been to craft an approachable and engaging step change of that signature. This Black almost Ops looks like a Black Ops experience. One map. We that focused cool. on supporting three core play styles for launch. Enforcers Cold the Weather Prestige was like DLC. That's disgusting. Recon is all about intel and counter. Oh my god. And strategists are support players who throw their bodies at objectives for the win. I love the trophy system. The Sam. All wow. of our weapons, gear, and gadgets in multiplayer have been intentional. Man, I just missed the ACR. Where's the ACR? That's Modern Warfare, though. It's not and of in course, here. It wouldn't be a Black Ops game I wish. I missed the Commando, man. Mm, I love the Commando. Which we're happy to announce the Moss Commando. Mm. Oh, look, theater mode. Oh, look at no, that. Cool. Some details on maps. Listen, Treyarch has, the, has a map we're like, you know, that we will be this launching them. With 16 all new MP maps. Wow. 12 core 66 and four strike maps, which can be played as 66 or 2v2. What the hell? What do players like? What do we know that they want? Yeah, where's so war? Classic, He's bald. Wow. Maps. We've got fast, frenetic experiences, and we have that balance. Maps look nice. The graphics look nice, size, though. Like better for the, again, like I keep PC. saying, the graphics keep always the look nice, flowing, though. But, but still have me. Yeah, she is bald. Wow. Well. Or maybe she's not. Maybe she has her hair tied. The Who maps knows? have their own stories, and we have multiplayer taking place after the campaign, after you finish oh. it. So I don't want to get into too many spoilers there, but you'll experience some. Of the hunty, she doesn't spoil, unlike you. Lens. Wow. Yeah, she is bald. I think. Wow. We've covered a lot today. Please, zombies. Are those the gobble gums? One more thing. Please, please, Zombo. Oh god, there's a fat one! What the was that the Gersh? This almost looks like Fire BC. Kowloon. Kowloon mixed with Fire BC. Round base zombies is back. And we're I need picking to raise up the Dark shit. Aether we're excited Which is... to announce that there will be two brand new maps available at launch. Wow. A curated mix of fan favorite features and new elements to discover. Two maps is For so shit. Zombies, it's our unique take on the cooperative horde mode where every map is packed full of powerful weapons yeah, and upgrades. Yeah, every one of the two, yeah. And tons of secrets to uncover. Easter the eggs, yeah. Zombies is incredibly important to Treyarch, and we are so proud it of what the mode be. is bringing to players in Black Ops 6. Yeah, can you tell As you've us heard something? Today, the innovations and in movement systems will also yeah, be they're all coming inside. Wow, Plus, okay, cool. There are many additional zombie-specific features, both new and returning. This is going to be a truly epic They're not going to tell us anything, are they? Zombies. Be on the lookout for more intel yeah. coming later this year. Oh my god, but they it's always cuck us with zombies. Now we know we only gave you a little taste of multiplayer here today, so make sure to mark your calendars oh for a worldwide God. multiplayer reveal event at Call of Duty Next on August 28th. Oh wow, okay. Sure How far is that? We're in uh, favorite streamers get June, Black Ops July, 6. like two months. So huh? and ready to jump no map names. Yeah, no nothing. They didn't show us shit. We'll be sharing so much more about Black Ops 6 in the coming months and look forward Man. to reactions. And your feedback from our open beta coming up this fall and into launch. Some bullshit. That guy's face looked funny. The Hellstorm missile. Whoa. The team is already focused on delivering a ton of content in the live seasons, which we'll be sharing more about. Wow. Am I allowed to talk about Warzone yet? Warzone? Man, that should be its own separate thing. I'm involved with Black Ops. Black Ops 6 was and still is to make something that is the best work we've ever done and frankly the most fun to play. To do that, we deconstructed all of our gameplay, our systems, and content plans, and repeatedly asked how something could be better. In some cases, that led us to huge innovations like Omni Movement, where we're now allowing the players Omni to movement. move how real people and operators move. 
In other cases, it led us back to some of our classic They love systems showing off speech. fucking multiplayer. Then this is crazy. System through the ringer and making updates and improvements. Across our weapons, gear, operators, maps, and more, a huge push has been to hit the highest visual what and the audio. Hell was possible. that shit? The campaign tells an all new Black Ops story where you're forced to go rogue and are being hunted by the teams that trained you. On top of that, wow. the team is really focused on mission and engagement variety. Multiplayer is a key ingredient in the DNA of Black Ops, and hopefully, in this sneak peek, it was clear that every single part of the MP game loop will be improved and better than ever. From movement, it looks like they're reading off a script. I mean, they probably are, but like, they're making it kind of obvious. They love showing that fucking flip. Oh my god, yeah, the return. I don't know, that map looks whatever. I want a cooler map. Before the game map looks whatever. On October, 25th. October 25th. Dude, the fucking mannequin grabbing you looks funny. Team, we can't wait for you to play Call of Duty Black Ops 6. Uh, oh my god, the way he killed him there. Oh. Okay, you see the bullets in that one. It's on a sea defense rig. Yeah. I thought it was just like a mountain hill village thing, but it could be a sea defense rig. Okay. Oh man, the vault edition. What the fuck? Was that Brutus? That was Brutus. Oh, of course, there's a battle pass. What the fuck? There was Brutus there. They love Brutus. That is so ass. And right, now they're gonna recap everything. Cool. He really showed the new WoW expansion. I think that's crazy. Whoa. Doom. Diablo. God, the Diablo thing is so sick. The Indiana Jones shit was so ass. <laughs> Gobble Gum Pack is pre order bonus. Well, it's cool that those are coming back. Nah, that, the Fable game looked good. The mech game looked really good, too, honestly. The mech game looked really interesting. This game looked dumb. This game was alright, I guess. Wait, what the fuck? Was that Cyberpunk? No, it wasn't. The Assassin's Creed looks alright, I guess. It's Assassin's Creed. Fucking, most of these zombies game looks stupid. This game, they keep showing. They don't stop showing. Life is Strange, Instant for me, that's cool. E-Day, cool. Wow. This game's dumb, like I said, this game looks dumb. Vowed, Starfield, Flight... Flight Simulator, unironically, looked really good. Wow. Metal Gear was alright. Mixtape looked dumb. This game looks okay. Adam Fall looked good. Fall 76 is whatever. State of K3, more zombies, whoopee. I don't know how that shit still survives, but... When will we get a Superman game? That's a great question. There used to be a lot of Superman games when we were kids. 20 years ago, 15 years ago, which is crazy to say. Oh, Bean's getting one? Yeah, I know. Alright. There it is. Cool. Alright, so now we can wrap up the video. Let me see this trailer you sent me, though. Let me see what it looks like. The reveal trailer. Did we already basically see this? Uh, uh, yeah, we already saw this. They showed this in the thing. Yeah. Yeah, we basically already saw this shit. Yep. Ah, uh, yeah, we don't, we don't need to watch that. Yeah, this is fine. Anyway, so, you know, uh, just to round it out, just to give my opinions, because, you know, I'm shoving this on YouTube, too. The whole... How long did we go for? The whole almost two hours. Um, yeah, I don't know. I think a big issue that I have, and I don't know when this started, but I've had it for a while. It's just, I feel like I'm past most games things. Like when I was a kid, when I was very, very early on, I was only interested in certain things in games and that was flying, right? Now, when I was a kid, I just needed things to pass the time. So I would play stuff like Spyro, Crash Bandicoot, all these other things, but it eventually got to the point where I really liked flying in games and I honed in on that. And then after that, I re I re went out. I got into Final Fantasy. I hated it. I got into COD. I loved it. From COD, I got into other games. I eventually got to PC after all the shooter 
craze I went through and zombies craze. And then from there I went into MOBAs, excuse me, tried MMOs, but typically kept around FPS for the most part. But you know, I've played these other story games too. I'm not going to say I haven't. I've played almost every type of game, racing, fighting, shooter, obviously some more than others. But overall, when I was a kid, I went through different phases, like I said. Now, I was a lot more interested in these things as a kid, I feel like. I think things were more hyped, obviously for the big games like Fallout, Call of Duty, Gears, Halo was a big one. I'm surprised they didn't show anything for Halo, honestly. Thank God they didn't show anything for Forza. But I think as an adult, right now, I'm just always comparing, which is never too good to do. But when I see these games, it's like, and this just might be just me really just not liking games as much as I did anymore. It's like why do i care why do i want to play this what's interesting about this and the fact that i have to even ask that kind of already tells the answer of you know i'm kind of not really into it anymore as i was because if you need a reason to do something if you need to think of a reason then you're not really into it if you need to like really really dig deep or maybe you know maybe things have changed who knows but yeah the fact that black ops 6 is 300 gigs is insane thank god i have so much space in my computer and that's another thing like consoles suck like bro the consoles are like one terabyte two terabyte if you shell out even more one terabyte is nothing nowadays my pc has like seven terabytes of space four on one drive three on another two on the last one so you know we're doing pretty good on space for me but even then eventually that's not gonna be too good but either way um yeah i don't know so it's like a lot of games now i often see like how do they stand out what makes them unique i'm a way tougher critic than i was right way way tougher critic than i was so now and for instance it's with the freaking game with the stupid catfish for the fucking southern mississippi people it's like okay that boss had like a rolling attack like okay that's cool but it's like when you're older it's like you've experienced that if you're a gamer how many times where a boss has a rolling attack and i might be overly critical i might be just focusing on this one but it's the general theme of like a lot of stuff just isn't unique to me anymore a lot of stuff i've seen it a hundred times and you see it a hundred times it gets boring it's the same reason why i stopped playing minecraft it was the same thing over and over and over again not to say these aren't bad and i'm not saying like you know the current generation the younger generation can't enjoy this they certainly can but as a person who's more mature as a person who's experienced this it's like how is this unique anymore i don't i don't know you know not much of this impressed me also because i just i guess i just really don't care for most of them i still care for obviously gears and stuff but less and less, you know, now I'm, I'm going back into my specific tastes. I still love roguelikes. I love games where you farm, where you can invest time into. Because a lot of other problems with these games is I don't think they're going to last long. They're just kind of, I don't want to say quick cash grabs, but that's sometimes what they end up being because they really, really don't last long. And everything nowadays, the thing that really thrives is live service. So there's definitely a big shift in gaming and what it's become. But um, just to kind of, I say, you know, condense it to this showing i think it was okay i don't think it was terrible a lot of stuff i didn't care about some stuff did look decent uh, most of the stuff i'm never gonna fucking touch play or remember probably because it doesn't matter to me but objectively speaking looking i think it was all right was there anything zombies really yeah they did show some zombie stuff barely anything it's stuff that hunter you told me too they're releasing two maps they're going back to round based all the movement from multiplayer is going to zombies obviously they have a season pass for multiplayer. I don't know if it's going to be related to Zyves, but probably. They have a pre-order bonus with Gobble Gums, so Gobble Gums are coming back. And that's about it. What map? We don't know. They, they barely told us anything. They said, hey, we have two maps. Round base is coming back. You're going to like it. We made it better. There you go. But um, that's about it. Yeah, so just looking at the whole, at the whole show, I would probably rate it. And again, my rating system is like... Wow, some guy said Silk Song, please. Wow, they are desperate. They are desperate for Hollow Knight's game, and I don't know what Team Cherry is doing, but anyway. Um, yeah, to kind of rate everything, right? About multiplayer, multiplayer is multiplayer. It's the same shit. Really nothing different. And that was the other thing I forgot to mention, right? The main thing, no, 12, no, 16 maps, they said. 12, like you know 6v6 maps and then six or four 6v6 slash 2v2 maps but anyway one of the things i want to say for call of duty is um oh the temp pick system is coming back whoopee the main thing i want to say for call of duty is the main thing i always liked about call of duty was the um did they forget birthdays also they did wow the main thing about call of duty that um 
I want to point out is I always played for um, I always played for kill streaks. I thought the kill streaks were like really really cool, and especially when we went to the futures, like the new kill streaks always astounded me. Now it's like I don't know what new kill streaks they could do. It's like I again, it's the problem of I'm too old. I've seen it all. They can't surprise me anymore. I mean, they can try, but it's harder. So, uh, you know, it's really fucking hard. But anyway. To kind of wrap it up and say everything about this this thing, which they didn't show Silk Song, which is really sad, honestly. Um, and Elder Scrolls. They didn't show Forza, thank God. They didn't show Elder Scrolls, which is sad, and they didn't show Silk Song, which is really sad. But um overall I think looking at this, I think it was okay. So five out of ten for me is always neutral. But I think that I would rate it probably six phil spencers out of ten i don't think there was anything too egregious there was some stuff i was like why the fuck are they focusing on this why the fuck is this here a lot of stuff sometimes looks stupid as hell but um oh look they're gonna have the black ops 6 direct uh right after the showcase so pretty soon but um yeah th this is like i don't know I, I would say a solid like six out of ten the indiana jones shit i think was dumb a lot of other games that were dumb some of the games that were good, they barely spent any time on, which is sad, but either way. Oh, that's what we saw. That was the Black Ops 6 Direct. That was short as shit. Wow. But yeah, 6 out of 10 for the whole thing. It's whatever. I'm not really much into games, but I still am in certain ways. But uh, yeah, that's about it. Hopefully everyone buys the Game Pass and makes Phil Spencer, uh, Phil Spencer a little bit fatter. Anyway, that's going to be it for me. I hope everyone enjoyed. Watch me at Twitch TV slash Technic Channel, where I do this live.